What happens if you ejaculate every day? It's a question many men have pondered, but might be hesitant to voice. In a world with an abundance of conflicting information, discerning what's truly healthy can be challenging. Is frequent ejaculation a sign of a robust libido, or could it potentially be excessive? Today, we will address this subject directly. We'll offer a balanced, fact-based examination of the science behind daily ejaculation. We won't provide a simple yes or no answer, because the reality is far more intricate. Instead, we'll explore both the potential advantages and the possible challenges linked to this frequency. We'll begin by looking at five potential benefits that research suggests could stem from daily ejaculation. Then, we'll shift our focus to discuss five potential issues you should be aware of. By the end of this discussion, you'll possess a much clearer understanding of how this very personal habit can influence your physical and mental well-being. Let's start with the positive aspects. What are the potential benefits of ejaculating every day? It stimulates the production of pleasure hormones. When you ejaculate, your brain releases a combination of feel-good chemicals. These include endorphins, which act as the body's natural pain relievers and mood enhancers. You also experience a rush of dopamine, a neurotransmitter linked to pleasure and reward. And oxytocin, frequently referred to as the love hormone, which fosters bonding and relaxation. Additionally, there's serotonin, which aids in mood regulation and contributes to feelings of contentment and happiness. This hormonal release explains why individuals often feel relaxed, happy, and satisfied after an orgasm. Consistent release of these hormones can contribute to an improved overall mood and help reduce stress levels. The second benefit is enhanced sleep. If you've ever felt drowsy after ejaculating, you're not alone. This sensation is largely due to the release of a hormone called prolactin. Prolactin induces feelings of relaxation and sleepiness, which is why many men find it easier to fall asleep after sexual activity or masturbation. The same pleasure hormones we just discussed, such as oxytocin and endorphins, also contribute to stress reduction and promote a state of calm, facilitating sleep. For individuals who struggle with insomnia or restless nights, this natural sedative effect can be a significant advantage, leading to better quality sleep and consequently, more energy throughout the day. Third on our list is the promotion of vasodilation, which simply refers to the widening of your blood vessels. During sexual arousal and orgasm, your heart rate increases and blood flow improves throughout your entire body, not exclusively your genitals. This physiological process helps your blood vessels expand, which is beneficial for your cardiovascular system. Improved blood circulation ensures that oxygen and essential nutrients are efficiently delivered to all your organs and tissues. Over the long term, this can contribute to better heart health and may even assist in lowering blood pressure. Consider it a miniature workout for your circulatory system. The fourth benefit is one of the most widely discussed, a reduced chance of prostate cancer. Several significant studies have investigated this correlation. The most notable example is a long-term study from Harvard University, which monitored over 30,000 men for nearly two decades. The findings published in the journal European Urology indicated that men who ejaculated frequently specifically 21 or more times per month, had a notably lower risk of developing prostate cancer compared to those who ejaculating less often. The leading hypothesis suggests that frequent ejaculation helps to cleanse the prostate, clearing it of potentially harmful substances and old cells that could otherwise accumulate and potentially become cancerous. Well, this is not a guarantee. It provides compelling evidence that regular ejaculation may play a protective role for the prostate. Finally, the fifth benefit is an improvement in your immune system. You might not instinctively consider ejaculation as a method to ward off illness, but some research indicates it can be helpful. Studies have demonstrated that sexual arousal and orgasm can elevate the levels of certain antibodies, such as immunoglobulin A or IgA. IgA represents one of your body's primary defenses against viruses and bacteria. Furthermore, 
The stress-reducing effects of orgasm also play a crucial role here. Chronic stress is known to suppress the immune system, making you more susceptible to illness. Ah! By helping to reduce stress levels, regular ejaculation can indirectly support a stronger and more responsive immune system, assisting you in maintaining overall health. Now that we've explored the potential upsides, it's essential to examine the other side of the coin. What are the potential problems or downsides of ejaculating every day? The first potential issue is that it can develop into a psychological compulsion. It is crucial to differentiate between a healthy habit and a compulsive behavior. If you derive enjoyment from daily ejaculation and it does not negatively affect your life, it is likely not a concern. However, if you experience an overwhelming urge to do it every day and it begins to interfere with your work, social life, or responsibilities, it might be becoming a compulsion. Compulsive behavior is characterized by a loss of control, where the act is no longer a choice, but a perceived necessity. This can lead to feelings of guilt or shame and may suggest an underlying psychological issue that requires attention. Second, it can be utilized as an emotional crutch. Many individuals turn to masturbation and ejaculation as a way to cope with feelings of stress, anxiety, fear, or sadness. The release of pleasure hormones offers temporary relief, making it an effective short-term coping mechanism. The problem arises when this becomes the sole method you use to deal with negative emotions. Relying on ejaculation as an emotional crutch can hinder your development of other, more sustainable coping strategies, such as exercise, meditation, or communicating with a friend or a therapist. It effectively masks the underlying problem without actually resolving it, which can be detrimental to your long-term emotional health. The third potential problem relates to fertility, a decrease in the quantity of sperm in the semen. Your body requires time to produce and mature sperm. While production is continuous, a complete replenishment can take approximately 72 hours. When you ejaculate daily, your body may not have sufficient time to fully restore its sperm reserves to maximum levels. Ah. This results in a lower sperm count per ejaculation. For most men, this poses no issue. However, if you and your partner are actively attempting to conceive, daily ejaculation might diminish your chances of success. In this specific scenario, spacing out ejaculations by two to three days can help ensure a higher concentration of sperm, increasing the likelihood of fertilization. Fourth is a potential decrease in desire. While it may seem counterintuitive, ejaculating too frequently can sometimes lead to a lower libido. This is partly because the brain can become accustomed to the constant release of pleasure hormones. If your brain's reward system is continually activated, it can become desensitized over time, meaning you may require more stimulation to achieve the same level of pleasure and your overall spontaneous desire might decrease. Furthermore, there is the refractory period, the time a man needs to recover after an orgasm before he can become aroused again. While this period varies, constant ejaculation can keep your desire at a lower baseline Sometimes a brief period of abstinence can help reset your system and rekindle that sexual spark. The fifth and final potential problem is that it can contribute to premature ejaculation and erectile dysfunction. This is particularly true if daily ejaculation occurs through rapid masturbation. If you develop the habit of rushing to reach climax as quickly as possible, you are essentially training your body and brain for a sprint, not a marathon. This conditioning can be difficult to unlearn and often translates into premature ejaculation during partnered sex. Moreover, this can create a cycle of performance anxiety. Worrying about lasting longer can, in some cases, contribute to psychological erectile dysfunction, where the fear of not performing well makes it difficult to achieve or maintain an erection. The focus shifts from pleasure to performance, which can be damaging to a healthy sex life now, let's summarize the key takeaways about ejaculating every day. To wrap things up, what happens if you ejaculate every day? As we've seen, it's not a straightforward question with a simple answer. It's a complex topic with a range of potential effects. On one hand, it can offer significant benefits, 
from boosting your mood and improving your sleep to potentially lowering your risk for prostate, cancer, and strengthening your immune system. On the other hand, it carries potential risks, such as becoming a psychological compulsion, an emotional crutch, or contributing to fertility and sexual performance issues like premature ejaculation. Ultimately, the key is balance and self-awareness. There is no magic number that is right for everyone. The most important thing is to listen to your own body and mind. If ejaculating daily makes you feel good, reduces your stress, and doesn't interfere with your life, then it's likely a healthy practice for you. However, if you feel it's become a compulsion, if you're using it to avoid dealing with your emotions, or if it's causing issues in your sex life, it might be time to reassess. If you have any concerns about your sexual health, it's always best to speak with a doctor or a mental health professional, such as Dr. Laura Rodriguez, to gain personalized insights and guidance. If you found this video helpful and informative, please give it a thumbs up, subscribe to the channel for more content like this, and hit the notification bell so you don't miss our next video. I'd also love to hear your thoughts, so leave a comment below. Thanks for watching.